A historic native group made a stop in Golden Valley this week. Emily Haugen introduces us to the storytellers of Spider Woman Theater. My father bought a big, beautiful red and white boat. There's nothing like a well-told story. <laughs> and the next summer, my father would paint it and hawk it and pit it and hose it down. And all our friends and relatives would <laughs> Within the Spider Woman Theater, these women have a knack for it. Their unique theater-making methodology is story weaving. The New York-based group has roots in telling indigenous stories, founded by Muriel Miguel in 1975. What I think about all the time, for the impact, two young ones, and someone looks at me and, and gets the idea, that big, you know, that big light goes up. Our family really came from showbiz Indians. This week, the women traveled to Purpose Arts High School in Golden Valley. They weren't there to perform, but to share their perspective. And I think it's so important for students of color, for indigenous students, to be able to see these amazing leaders, to know that people have been doing this work for centuries. This was part of how I was learning from open theater. Spider Woman is the oldest, continually running Native feminist theater company in the Americas. The teachers would sit there and say things like, the culture is dead, you don't have a culture anymore. They weave Native stories with contemporary experiences. One of the beautiful things I think about this work is it really does incorporate all arts areas. There is dance, there is music, there is visual art, there is storytelling, and it's all woven together, and that's also, I think, reflective of Indigenous artistic and cultural practice. The group is no stranger to pushing boundaries. In their early days, Muriel says they shined a light on abuse. Putting the light on things that have happened and everyone's ignoring. Can't do that anymore. Emily Haugen, CCX News. You can learn more about Spider Woman Theater's mission online at ccxmedia.org. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.